right, so here's where we're camping. We should look familiar, familiar to some of you all. Water bottle. Right at the moment, B Rad is fixing Travis's fire pit here. He didn't like what you had done with the place, Travis. He said he's remodeling. So I'll get y'all back with us later on once we get uh, everything set up. I've only got one battery with me, so I'll have to keep it short and sweet so that way I can get the entire trip. So I'll talk to you guys here later on. All right, so I got everything set up. There's a uh, Aqua Quest Safari tarp, ten by ten. Got it set up with Prusik knots toggle, so I could stretch it out. Ridge lines over it so that the water won't come in. And then Atlas straps run into the hammock. Hammock is just a single $30 Walmart hammock. Um, tie outs, I've just got them running. The adjustable AquaQuest ones that come with the tarp. Going down to the little pegs. And yeah, that's pretty much it as far as shelter goes. Getting ready to build a fire. Brad's got the fire pit all cleaned out and ready to go. And then packs on a tree. I guess I could walk around and show you all some of this off the hill here. I don't know if y'all can see down in there how well this shows for you all, but there's a creek down there. It looks dry right at the moment, but creek is down there. The way that the sun is right now coming through some of the trees and some of them it ain't makes it really hard to show y'all some stuff because it just keeps auto focusing on and off. But I'll bring you back once we get a fire going. It's about the edge of dark. Like I said, I already got the uh, camp set up there, my area, hammock, tarp. Got a pretty decent stack of firewood there. Fire is going. My little fire pit. A buddy of mine's, uh, I think this is his walking stick from the last time. Dude's tent and stuff. So everything's pretty good. Wait for it to get a little bit darker, and once it gets dark, then I'll bring you all back and see if uh, we can't find something interesting so it ain't perfect but here's our couch bug out couch, bug out couch <laughs> by the fire what I'm thinking is anybody that comes out here to this camp sorry if it's shaking guys I couldn't pack a tripod all the way up here and all that crap also so it's all freehand but anybody that comes up here to the camp hopefully they'll uh, you know just do a little bit of something here and there. Maybe build another bench over there on that side of the fire or some tables or something. If you got a better idea of how to do the couch, then, you know, make it sturdier or whatever. And, um, you know, hopefully one day this could be a nice permanent camp since, you know, everybody comes here every year or whatnot. Be back once it gets dark, guys. There's our fire for the night. I'm not even zoomed in. <laughs> It's kind of roaring here. Can't really see anything else, but. It's a hell of a fire. Bring y'all back in the morning. All right, everybody, this is the morning after. Um, really didn't shoot no footage this morning. It was freezing to death, woke up, it was 51 degrees. And all I had was a poncho liner and my hammock. So, um, sorry about that but I'll make sure next time to get the morning footage basically all we did was pack up and take off 
until I see you again, if you like what you see, you know, subscribe, uh, share with some of your friends who may like the video, and uh, always appreciate your support, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks.